Hey, what's up guys? Chandler here. This is another Patreon early access video. So if you want to see early videos like this, or you want to support the channel going forward, feel free to head over to patreon.com slash Chandler Burton Entertainment to join the $1 tier. You're going to get access to block videos, early access videos like this. Uh, you're also going to get shout outs and videos on a whole bunch of other perks. So again, if you want to support the channel going forward, there's a link down below in the description and the pinned comment. But without further ado, I hope you guys enjoy the video. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Chandler Burton Entertainment, or if you're on my Patreon, welcome to the Early Access. I hope y'all are doing well. Today on the channel, we are checking out the Devil Wars Prada, but we are checking out the four acoustic renditions of some of their songs off the new Code Decay Deluxe album. We are checking out Salt, Broken, Sacrifice, and Cancer. Really excited to check this out with you guys. I am an absolute sucker. For acoustic renditions of songs, especially from songs I like that are already considered metalcore. So I am so excited to see what these songs have in store. Excited to have the some new life breathed into these songs, which is going to be really cool. My story with the Devil Wears Prada, I honestly, it's so incredible because again, back in high school, I used to listen to Plagues with Roots, Abru Roots Above and Branches Below. And I was like, dude, nothing will, e no one will ever top this band for me. Then after Death Throne, I kind of fell off them a little bit. I listened to a song every so often, but I just wasn't impressed. And I was like, you know what? Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I don't want to listen to these guys anymore. But I was brought back into the fold with that Zombie 2 EP. And I was like, this is incredible. It's a little bit different than the first one, but honestly, maybe a hot take. I like them both about the same. I think Zombie 1 and Zombie 2 are equal like in my like level of enjoyment. And then they dropped Color Decay, which was one of the most emotional metal records I've heard in such a long time. That album to me is still a 10 out of 10, at least when it comes to the emotion. I It's so crazy how much that album made me cry and resonated with me. So I'm sure these acoustic versions will definitely hit me in the feels as well. So excited to jam with you guys here. I'm excited to dive right in. But before we get started, huge shout out to all my patrons that are going to be on the screen and the description down below. And I do want to thank every single one of you for your continued support support at Chandler Burton Entertainment and if you would like to become a member of the Patreon family and support me as a creator there is always a link down below in the description and at the pinned comment let's not waste any more time and let's dive right in okay just got to mentally prepare myself although I know what the lyrics are and you know I, I am excited to hear the acoustic version but maybe I won't uh, cry as much as I did as I did in my full album reaction so I just got to prepare myself here again four songs we are starting with salts and with all four songs in total it's about 13 minutes and 23 seconds so really excited to jam with you guys here let's go ahead and pop it off in three two and one <laughs> Also, I love the colors of uh, of the person. That's really cool. I can never process what I'm feeling in my bones like a sickness that I can't diagnose. Some days I think I'm afraid of my shadow. I show up to fight at all the wrong battles, and I don't think my mind will be right till I yeah. are the salt and through the wounds. Ooh, let the beautiful. rain wash over you. If everything I said was true, Jeremy's voice is so good. I paralyzed. Oh, okay, the, the this part here is usually pretty fast, but they're slowing it down for the acoustic. I love that. Watch the grass blow in the wind for the hell of it. Ooh. And sometimes Ooh. I get so cut up that I forget. All of our words only mean what's behind now You can't throw gasoline on the fire And say you tried to put it out Makes the lyrics stand out more, I love that Pour the salt into the wounds Let the rain wash over you If everything I said was true Then why am I Hiding from the blinding lights I never had an alibi If everything I said was true Then why am I? Why am I still paralyzed? 
love how the screaming is still in the background too. I think that's actually really cool. Like I wanted to have that on Broken as well. I love Broken. That's like the jam, dude. That's like the emotional jam. I love how they, it sounds like they went back and re-recorded some of the vocals, because sometimes, like, artists would just take, like, the singing from the original song and just put it over the acoustic track, but it sounds like they went back and re-recorded some of the, some of the words, I love that. Oh, beautiful. I love that, dude. Love the background and stuff. I thought that was really cool. All right, next one is Broken, which I'm, I, this is the one I'm most excited for. I love the original song, so let's see how this one hits. Love the lyrics on this one. This one made me emotional, dude. I hate when I get left alone. I'm sure that all these calls are getting old. A short drive. Ooh. Just get me home. Oh, I love the vibe on this. The cost is nowhere near to what I own. Oh, they turned tune down Mike there. He usually screams there. From the back of the car and sinking in oh. Like a shot of fear and adrenaline I'm a lost cause with nothing left Can't you see that? My hands are torn up from all these broken bottles Yeah, this is getting me a little emotional, dude I can lost too much I know no, I've got my problems Oh, a little grit there that was, that was nice. That was a nice boy. My problems. Oh, dude. I didn't start this episode. It's got me crawling and flying. I'm high and I'm low. Is that Mike singing? I watch from afar and make my best. No, I don't think so. As you sit back. instruments sound on this it's like it's not just your typical playing it's like there's a lot to it and i love that oh build up yeah this is more of like a reimagining more than an acoustic which i love sounds so good Love that part, dude. That was beautiful. That was like, I love the instruments on that, dude. That was so sick. Okay, next song is Sacrifice, which should be really interesting to hear. 
that breakdown, the beefy boy at the end. I wonder what we're gonna do about that part. See, it's cool to like hear like it's it's so cool to do a reaction to it because I want to see what we're gonna do. Watch the walls closing, your words drawn like a blade, contaminate my veins. I for fine. You bet the truth so you could play the victim. What's real fate? I swear I'm not paranoid. I let it like, in my vocal work for this, you know, like, it, cause like when he screams, he screams like a spoken word. And it kind of works for it, like the acoustic. Another fight, push me it kind of works. I like it. Cause I can be your sacrifice. Mm. Yeah, Jeremy and I together are just like perfect. Just great Rose back and forth. This cycle, all consumed by the numb word symptoms. And to create. There's no shelter beneath the rain. Shut yeah. me out, shut me out. Sick of the misdirection. You cut me down. That's what's real fate. I swear I'm not paranoid. Love the chorus here, man. I let it in as if I had a choice. Just bury me in red. Sacrifice. Dude, such cool lyrics, man. Like, it's relatable, but they tell it in such a cool way. Like, they're such good lyric writers where it's relatable, but the words they use are so clever. That's one thing about this band we I'm in. Like, I wish I could write like them, because they're so good. Relatable, but cool, like, words they use to describe how they're feeling. I love that. that same knife, twist the hand tool, side to side. We let the knot go, you let it I swear die. I'm not paranoid I let it in as if I had a choice Just bury me in red I don't want another fight Push me off the edge It's I can be your sacrifice Are they going to do it? I was going to say, they're not going to do the breakdown. Okay, last song, Cancer. This one really messed people up emotionally, dude. Like, reading all the comments on, like, the music video, just insane how much people opened up in regards to this song. And I'm, I, it's so, that's what I love about this community, that people are so open and so honest and that it's just a bunch of us that are just broken and they're willing to share their story to help other people. It's wonderful. But this song is insane, insanely emotional. Like, like I fell through the floor, crushed by another passing. It's all love the piano there. Before. Still, I'm not pretending to know every story. Oh, that's just beautiful, dude. I'm just some voice below the background noise. I hope that it's cancer. Oh, it's beautiful, dude. And not something else. Cause I don't need any more things. I don't want to talk. Such a thing Who am I to say Daily devastation That I can't validate What's wrong with you The lie 
ask about me You're done, you're through Still, I'm not pretending To know every story And every choice Gosh, it sounds so good, dude I hope that it's cancer And not something else It's like you don't want it to end because it's so good. Oh, look at those eyeballs are staring right at me. I see you. I see you. <laughs> Man, I love this, dude. I, I just love when bands do acoustic renditions of their songs. So I'm going to go in and give some overall thoughts. That's going to be the next slide over. So please stick around for that and let's talk about it. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk about the Devil Wears Prada and their four acoustic renditions of some of their songs off of Color Decay. Again, we just got done jamming Salt broken sacrifice and cancer absolutely love this again i am a huge sucker for when bands take metalcore songs or songs off their album and turn it into like acoustic honestly i'd probably instead of calling these acoustic i would probably call these like like honestly reimagined versions of these songs because it wasn't just acoustic the entire time we got like piano we did get some acoustic guitar we also got some screaming from mike in there which is pretty cool i know like for example when i first heard like someone screaming in an acoustic song was actually hollow front on their song called still life and i thought that was actually really cool honestly the screaming added more of the emotion to the songs while it was in the acoustic form of it and i thought that was really really cool and with Mike's voice, it's so unique. It just sounds like he's just kind of like really, he's like saying a spoken word. And he just sounds really passionate about it. So it didn't really sound like screaming. It just sounded like a guy who just really, you know, wanted to say something to get something off his chest. And it came off in such a beautiful way. I really think it would have been cool if he would have done a little bit of singing. I think that would have been really cool just to, you know, to try something a little bit new. Maybe he did. Maybe I miss it. But I believe the majority of it was Jeremy, which is completely fine because he's a phenomenal singer. But I mean, these songs are incredible. Like it just, it's not your typical, just like playing guitar through it and like, okay, that'll be good. You could tell they actually took their time and they're like, okay, how can we make this song sound, you know, familiar, but different. And not only did I think they accomplished that, they did it in such a beautiful way, like broken. I love that original song. But this one I might like a little bit better because I just love the way that it sounds. And then Cancer was just a piano all the way through. So each of the songs still sound different. And that's such a huge thing for me when like every, like when songs can sound different from one another. That's really a big standout. And they were able to do that on the acoustic version of these songs. So that just proves to me that Devil Wears Prada is just so talented in everything that they do. I also just, again, I love the way they portray their lyrics. Like I kept saying it during the reaction, like they, they have lyrics that are super relatable and you know what they're talking about, but the way that is portrayed through the words is so clever and well-written that it honestly does make me jealous of how well they can write these songs. These four songs are an absolute masterpiece. The album, in my opinion, Color Decay, is still a masterpiece of an album. Again, I love how I see like other reactors, other people open up saying how much this album has impacted them emotionally, and I think that's so cool that we can come together and just love the one thing we love most, which is this kind of music. So I absolutely was a huge fan of all four of these songs, but I do want to pass on to you guys here. Let me know your favorite song off of Color Decay. Also, let me know your favorite rendition of the four songs. Was it was it Salt? Was it Sacrifice, Broken, or Cancer? Let me know down below. I love to get a back and forth conversation. Start with you guys. My other Devil Wars Prada reactions will be down below in the description for you all to check out. My next slide over is going to be all my socials. If you don't mind sticking around for that, that would be great. 
And before you go, do, before you go, if you don't mind, I know it's been a long video, but if you could please hit the subscribe button, the like button, share the video with your friends. It does help me as a creator and it does help the YouTube algorithm. So thank you to everybody who does do that. It means the absolute world. But again, I want to thank you all so much for taking some time out of your day to watch videos at Chandler Burton Entertainment. I hope you found some new music. I hope your mental health improves. But above all else, I want you to know that every single one of you are loved. And until next time, I hope you all take care. Keep jamming the devil word for Rada. Me cry.